912 from art about his homeland Rwanda to paintings tied to the Spurs. A local artist who uses vibrant colors to tell stories is getting ready to showcase his latest work. Tiffany Huetas takes us to his new exhibit at the Carver Community Cultural Center and to, to tell us more about how his love for art began. Good morning, Tiffany. Good morning, Mark and Stephanie. Really exciting work here at the Carver. Now this exhibit opens tonight and it's so colorful. Just take a look. It's called Art is Freedom. The artist, Alan Gekwaya, says his love for art began in third grade when his teacher requested he draw for his entire class. And Alan, these pieces are incredible. Good morning and thank you for joining us. Talk to us about your artwork. Yes, uh, thank you. Um, so my name is Alan Gekwaya. Say like uh, I've been been senator for 11 years now, and yeah, now I do art full time for um, you know myself, and I'm just like very very excited to share that um, you know art is freedom for the exhibition that's going to be up for two months, and yeah, so this was one of the pieces that I just showed uh, in New York, uh, January 12 at the, the Sheen Center and it's got like a lot of different elements. You got the coin that's like from where I come from, Rwanda. This is like a, one of the earrings that I broke apart, I put in there. Um, this is one of the watch I used to have. It's a, it's a citizen watch, uh, citizen watch. so I put in citizen of Rwanda and US because now I'm a dual citizenship, which is awesome. And yeah. What does it mean to you to have this exhibit here? Uh, what it means for me to have this exhibition, it's, it's really, it's very inspiring. Um, I want to show other artists, other, you know, people of color, people, you know, just minorities, people come from different areas to really just like believe in themselves and like really, you know, chase their dreams, you know, go after, yeah, what they, you know, want to go after in their life, so. And as we mentioned, some of your pieces were at the airport. This is one of them, right? Yes, yeah, this is one of the pieces that we used uh, for the San Antonio air, air, uh, Airport. And it was up for about four months, if I believe uh, correctly. So that was like a really super inspiring moment uh, because I know a lot of you know eyes got to see that piece. So. Yeah, that was really um, inspiring, and it's got like a lot of different elements also that um, that meet something you know uh, very important to me, like the the air cleaner right in the center. That's like from my 1978 Toyota Chinook. I've used for I think in like seven states. I used, and you know after I got back, you just kind of you know, give out and I was like, you know, gonna give you like a new purpose and now it's, you know, you know, piece of art, so. I love all the messages behind your pieces and I'm excited to continue to talk to you about this. We're gonna show you more of these pieces coming up on the Noon Show and again, this exhibition opens tonight and we're gonna have all those details on kset.com. We'll send it back to you. Hello everybody, Stefania Jimenez here. Thank you so much for watching KSAT's YouTube channel. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.